Welcome to another Sketching Specimens. Uh, today is, of course, Thursday, and it is insect day, so I'm trying to make the animals a little bit more of the scary ones. And eventually on Halloween, we'll do the vampire bats, so it's going to be kind of fun. Um, so we're gonna, we're do, today we're doing the stag beetle. Very interesting. Okay, so there are, there are, there we, in the, um, with the name Scaraboy, Scarabeoria. We're talking about scarab beetles and scarab beetles. There are tons of, of them across a, across the U.S., uh, but the one that we're talking about is a specific stag beetle that is common to Western Europe and Britain and uh, other parts of uh, Western Europe. So this, of course, is it's kind of your classic stag beetle with the two uh, stags or an or uh, antlers there. The, the 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 particular name for this one is Lucanus service, which is um, you know has that name Lucanidae, and this is uh, from from a eighteen which was from a eighteen or eighteen o four catalog. They have these large distinctive mandibles, which is what kind of gives them that stag beetle kind of name. We they are very very scarce in in population, and they are a protected species. Uh, most of their life is spent underneath the ground, and that is where they go to um, to lay their eggs. That's that's where most of their, of their life is spent. Um, they they emerge to mate and to and to reproduce. Uh, and they, they like to sit in rotting wood, um, like a f uh, forested areas where we have rotting wood or some sort of some sort of uh, uh, dirty like with with dirt and some and wood woody type of areas. Fallen trees, that kind of thing. Um, they have a black thorax. This they have black thorax, um, and they have chestnut wings. Uh, f females. This is the this is the, this is the female. They can bite well, while males will while males will not. The males with the big scary animals will not. Um, they they are not harmful, but they're but the females bite is rather painful. Um, they uh they look on the ground for a place to lay their eggs and they will kind of do that with and the rotting wood kind of does help that uh they will find some place of light soil to to, to do so males can be 32 75 millimeters that's how, how big they get females are smaller they're, they're about 30 to 50 mil, mil, millimeters they live in woodlands hedges orchards parks of of western europe that they feed on decaying wood underground uh, or uh, they will drink from sap runs or they will drink from uh, fallen fruit um, they uh, they do not start they do not survive the winter they have kind of a short lifespan they uh, they emerge from their from their larva they uh, basically you know feast off of whatever they mate they they lay their eggs and, and that's kind of partly it um, they their predators are cats, foxes, um, uh, and different kinds of birds, and they strike whenever they um, the females or, or males are, are seeking to mate. So they so they will come they will come to the ground whenever they are going to mate. So that the, these these predators will strike at them when they see them on the ground looking for a place to mate, or, to, or, the, or the female looking for a place to to the to, to, lay their eggs you have a habitat problem because of how uh, how uh, woodlands and places like that are being are being uh, taken down to for for, for development of houses and uh, commercial that kind of thing so that is a problem we have a scarcity of, of, of these guys I think they're a fantastic little little um, animal um, these are the, this is the female uh, you have the you still have mandals up here, but it's still a smaller, more stocky kind of build. Where this is kind of more of a sleek one. They are they are bigger, and these these the, the females are going to be all black, while the while the male stag beetles are going to have like a reddish or a purple on their back. And uh, I love these big mandibles there. It's very pretty, and I have down here the larva and that's kind of where they spend most most of their life so anyway it's a very awesome sp species the lucanus uh service i think that's awesome um i love i'll i'll be, I'll be, I'll be talking about some more creepy little 
species as we get to Halloween. And thank you guys very much for watching.